Hello guys, it's Triton Perfectly, and today you are at Triton's Vlogs. Now today we are going to be taste testing Mr. Beast chocolate bar and I will be telling you how they taste. So let's get into it. Now starting with the flavor, Mr. Beast milk chocolate made with grass fed milk. Looks interesting. These nuts milk chocolate with peanut butter grass fed milk. Looks pretty interesting. And it shows you a little peak of it, and that looks good. And then, Mr. Beast Bar Chocolate Sea Salt. Only five ingredients, and these ones are five, seven. These, this one is five ingredients and seven. And then this one is five. Chocolate Sea Salt. And then this one is almond chocolate with almond chunks. As you can tell right there. And this is five ingredients. You just look at the bottom. And then we have Mr. Beast Bar Original Chocolate. And this one is four ingredients. So the lowest ingredients we have. Okay, guys, let's get into it and start taste testing. First, we have milk chocolate. Let's test it. I can't get stuck. Daddy, I need your help. Let's try it. I mean... Milk chocolate, it tastes like, it doesn't taste like a little, it doesn't taste like milk in there, but it's pretty good. If you want to, just a quick bar, I'd probably get Mr. Beast chocolate bar one. I mean, it's in the middle, it's good and bad, but I would probably eat it. Unless this little piece right here says share. If I had to do one out of five, it would probably be a three, a solid three. Now, after that one, milk chocolate was pretty good. So now we're getting into these nuts. These nuts? Ha! <laughs> Got <he>. <laughs> <Got he> <laughs> This one is hilarious, hilarious, grass fed milk. Two thousand years later. Oh, the share was already open. Now we are gonna do these nuts. Try it. That's that's gross. <laughs> if you can tell, there's a little peanut butter inside. A lot of peanut butter. One out of five. Five. Mm -hmm. This was one of his new spars, I think. First, before I get into more, I'm gonna get a drink. Yo, yo! Ah! Here is the chocolate sea salt. See how good this tastes. Share, let's see how good this one is. I mean, it's kind of a taste like dark chocolate. I'll see the ingredients. If I was a little right, it was dark chocolate. Nope, not dark chocolate. Probably just a sea salt tasting. One out of five. Mm. 
four. Five ingredients. It's pretty good for five ingredients, to be honest. One out of five. Four. Five ingredients. It's pretty good for five ingredients, to be honest. Almond chocolate. Five ingredients. And same ingredients as this one, but not chocolate sea salt. I feel like I'm not going to like this one. Oh, I do not like that at all. If you like almond, then that this is your bar. But if you like me and you don't like almond, not your bar. bar. I mean, this one, one out of five, I got to give it a one. I really don't like almond chocolate. And if it was just... I mean, if they didn't put the chunks in there, I would love it. But I just can't do it on this one. I'm going to put that one back in there. Yeah, like I said, if you like almonds, then this is the bar for you. But if you're like me and you don't like almonds, nope. So now we are going to get into original chocolate. Two thousand years later. There. Original. Whoops. Devour. I mean, for four ingredients, it's pretty good, but it's probably a one out, one out of five. I would probably give it a three, three. If it's if it's like you're really craving chocolate, then this is what you would probably want. But um, today's video was um a pretty good one, and for Mr. Beast bars, one out of ten, it's a ten. Good job, Mr. Beast. And uh, like and sub and comment and thanks for watching. Peace, guys.